when you're not used to coming to places like this, you kind of like feel funny and out of place, but you don't know. The people here bring that smile. Once they bring that smile, make you feel like, okay, I can do this. If I can do it, you can do it. If you can do it, we all could do it for each other. I've been coming here for like two years. The food and stuff is here is really good. Yeah, the dates on the food is very good. The, there's a lot of good, healthy stuff here to eat. Fruits, vegetables. When I first came, and then people would tell me where I could go to pick up food on. And I got here and I was watching, watching the people. I said, oh, I'm gonna find out, you know, one day if I can volunteer. So I've been volunteering for seven years and Phil Abundance is great. I love it when I call Phil Abundance and I get someone on the phone and I tell them what my need is and they fix it right away. I don't have to wait and I'm telling you, they do it within five minutes. Vanessa will call you back with your questions and it's done. They help out with Christmas presents. They get stuff from Walmart. I mean, between everything that goes on here, it saves a lot of money, a lot of time, helps out a lot. This is so important because the need is so great. We serve a lot of senior citizens. They're on fixed incomes. They're so thankful to be able to receive the food that Phil Abundance supplies for us. It is an honor, it is my duty to continue to do this. As long as God gives me breath in my body, we're gonna to continue to do this. My first time coming, somebody was transgender and told me about getting food because I never had food abundance like this before. My pantry was always, the cupboard was always bare at a certain time. That's the first thing you bring is your patience. Because if you don't have that, it's not worth you standing in the line. And a lot of them, they can't, you know, they can't get to, you know, to the places where they can, you know, get the, the food or whatever. So I try to get it to them. A lot of people don't cook. They don't have a place to cook and stuff. These places provide people with little packets, things of like that. You know, during COVID season, we have the sanitizers and different things like that. And that really does help the next neighbor that don't come to the food bank line. We accept donations. We get a lot of donations. People find out what we're doing here and they're more than happy to donate. We have a closed closet. We're involved with the senior box program where seniors receive a 30 pound box of food with a block of cheese. We have over 100 people on that program and it works, it's great. Thank you, Phil Abundance. I'm glad I don't look like what I've been through. And that's all that matters to me. Hopefully, Phil Abundance let me come in and volunteer. <laughs> and the first thing I'm gonna bring is a smile. Cause I think that's important.